Hello guys, this is Anyeka Lebe and I'm back again today to explain to you guys how to make pipe with Z Pipe Maker. So um, I use the pipe to make um, this this pipe right here and this pipe here. I'm gonna have this one right here. So I'm gonna use the maker. You know, normally everybody can make um, pipe, but if you have the script, so it's gonna make your work easier and fun and easy to use. Um, so let's start. So um, let me just delete this so that I can start all over. So um, when you have, when you have um, finished ad ad downloading uh, the script, to us. so this is the zip pipe maker. Um, when you have it, just gonna open it. Let me delete this one. Is not gonna be part. This one is. It. So this is the um, pipe maker. So this is the instruction. On how to use it and this is the pipe so all you need to do is just open the instruction and copy these three guys after you might have um, moved these two guys right here to the script on your Maya so you just um, I like this and select copy and go back to your Maya open your Maya back and go to the script editor and you can clear everything and make sure it is in Python and just um, paste those two guys and just run it here so you have these guys and this is what we are looking for so um to have this guy this guy in case the next time you want to use it to add it to the shelf you can just select this and um press ctrl a to highlight everything go to the custom you want to add it to here so i'm just gonna middle click and drag it to the shelf and it's gonna ask is it male or python that you want to use just click on python so you have the python icon over there so next time that you want to use it all you need to do let me cancel this just go to this place and click it and there you have it so that is how to go about that so i have my um zip pipe maker right here so let's start the business so i'm just gonna go to new you can go to new pipe it's gonna create a new pipe so let me select new pipe so I have my new pipe, but this is so so big. Um, um. So to reduce this, I'm just gonna go to the radius. You can reduce the radius, and let me reduce the um scale, the curve scale. So it's gonna, so it's gonna bring it back. So I can press W on my keyboard and move it out to that place where I need it. So let me press F to um zoom on my object to so focus on my object. So um, the radius let me reduce the radius more so I think that is cool to that increase it a bit more to, yeah so that we can see it let me even increase it to this place so that uh, actually this is uh, too big but so that you can see what I'm doing clearly so this is the axis let's increase this to make it more round and the um, sub height if you increase this so you're gonna have uh, more edges on the height so I'm gonna reduce this because I don't need it now so um, let me increase it I think I'm gonna need it so reduce at the curve scale more so you know um uh, the pipe I want to make is gonna start from like goes this way but I don't want to rotate uh, this object this pipe right here I don't want to rotate him itself so I'm just gonna go to curve and curve it so curve amount go to 90 because we're gonna uh we're just gonna um like curve this in 90 degrees so i'm just gonna go to 90 but this is in opposite direction i don't want just go to the place and add minus 90 so i have it there so i'm just gonna bring it down to something like so so I so i just want to uh create a, a, a hedge for other extrude so um this is one um pipe in 90 degree curve so i'm gonna go to hard pipe and it's gonna have another pipe but with the curve it's want to maintain the curve so i need to go to the curve back and um bring it back to zero zero type zero so i have it straight and this edge the um sub height i don't need it so i reduce it and the scale curve scale i need to increase this so that to just keep um going I mean the cuff length or even the cuff scale it works so um let me 
bring it back a bit more so to that extent i, I think it's good there so i'm gonna add more pipe hard pipe so it's hard more pipe to that and i need to bring the scale back down and yes 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 bring it back more and go to the um sub height and increase that so that you can cough it in 90 degree more cough and want 90 and that is um facing up so to make it look for um for to the way you want it to go you need to go to um scale um cough scale and just scale it out a bit so um to face this side this direction like uh, you need to go to rotation 90 let's see so it's facing another way so it's gonna be negative that is it that is what i'm saying so um let's get going i think it's facing where we need it to face so let's add more pipe and it's going to maintain uh, um the curve so we need to go to the curve amount and take it back to one zero so it's facing the right direction now so i'm just gonna reduce um take off the um, sub height to one so i have none here because i don't need it and the curve scale let me zoom this thing out and just increase the curve still but i won't know where that guy is gonna stop because i don't have my gutter my plane over again so i'm gonna press this and press shift um h so it brings it back it brings it back so now i've deselected this um sky right here so if i when i click it back to make everything goes well because i'm gonna have issue with this even if these things work if as it works i need it to stick, um, click on connect controls so that i won't lose um the control of this guy so just click it you need to do this anytime you um on click um you select another object you need to um click this thing when you click this guy back to connect control so um let me continue my work so to that side right there yes to so something like that so i need to add more um pipe so it's continue if i add i I had not clicked the connect control might not work fine so because i've clicked this one that is why it's working fine so i need to um, bring it back so go to the curve uh scale so like so and increase the sub height i hope you can see what i'm doing increase the sub height more and use curve that is 90 doesn't work i need to rotate this in minus 90 let's try at minus 90 yes it works fine so that is what i want now the next thing now final is to add more pipe and change this rotation to zero and there i have it so i can remove the sub height i don't need it and i can increase the scale to face the gutter so um the water or the waste liquid is going to be um be directed from um this side to this side so when you are done here don't click any other thing except finish pipe so it's gonna duplicate um your object when you um press the finish pipe you're gonna have the pipe and pieces and a, a pipe as a mesh like a poly uh polygons mesh so finish pipe and it's selected the polygon one and um this is duplicated one you have the z pipe um, object and the um, polygon object so you need to go to this guy right here editor and set all these in because you're gonna um, change uh, the position so that you can um have that position back just go to this place all these ones um go to still select it. don't press anything when you are um when you press the finish pipe just go to freeze the transformation on that modifier and press that so now you can just move this guy back and go to this guy right here and delete this so that you can see all the pipe finish pipe yes that is the finish pipe this guy right here just delete it and there you have this one now you can go back here and press Z. so you have the original position that is what we want and that is our final pipe you see how fun it's uh, it works so um here that i said we're going to delete now you can just go to face mode and select this place and just delete it and there you can go to vertex select the vertexes and 
bring it in so you have it from that side and go back to object mode and it's done it's done it's done but if you want to make it an underground you can take it to the underground so you have it on that next the ground or let's just leave it there so that is how to go about it there are a lot of things that i didn't use here like um connect controls i used it but with one object the new pipe i used it and all these guys right here i used them but i didn't use this place this place that they are just quick as you can see quick settings like the bend is from the curve amount you can just come here like i was pressing bend 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 um 90 degree you can just come here click the bend and 90 degree click click in um 14 15 and zero degree so this works for the cover mount and the rotation this is rotation rotate rotate 90 degree minus 90 45 minus 45 you can use that now let me take another example using the connect controls so um let's assume i have let me create new this is this is a new pipe this is a new pipe and let me create another new pipe so i have two pipes right now so to um control these two pipes together maybe you want to keep them um, the same properties together you can just shift and select the other one and click on connect controls so it's connect um the two controls so if i had um new pipe oh sorry i intended to have add pipe connect control and add pipe so it works with the board so if i go to the rotation um the rotation or the amounts you see it's working together just because i had it the um connect pipe so if i had new pipe now um hard pipe and i can change this just change the amount or rotate it to this side so that is um what this one works for and like this one like i said if i press um rotate in minus um 45 plus 45 90 um minus 19 and 90 this is rotation quick settings so it works for these guys also and uh, the bend is the same thing like i said before so um now i deselected i've deselected this if i press this back i need to go to control back so that if i had any other one it's gonna work fine and if i don't want to work alone with this one i can shift and select this guy right here and say control uh, connect control and if i say add new so it's gonna work for the two so that is how i'm gonna add uh, the link or i can save it to the um fire media or media fire to the size to uh, sorry to say fire media so i'm gonna add it there so you can go there uh, and download it so that is how to go about the pipe zip pipe maker so thank you for watching uh, this tutorial i hope you enjoyed it thank you so much and um thank you my um, new subscribers for subscribing um saying we shall meet again in peace and not in pieces so and you could is saying peace out